This evening in Beckley, a group of veterans, local leaders, and Governor Justice broke ground on a new state-of-the-art nursing facility named in honor of a veteran and local hero. I want you right now to see the Charles Calvin Rogers nursing home that is going to be right on this place right here and it's going to be doing so much good for so many that deserve it so much it's unbelievable so give that family and all yourselves an incredible round of applause charles calvin rogers was born in claremont in fayette county and was awarded the medal of honor for his service during the vietnam war he finished his military career at the rank of major general and died in 1990. The new facility follows a small home design and will house 120 veterans. Each person will get their own residence and the layout will simulate a full neighborhood. The facility will provide top-of-the-line care and there will be a dedicated Alzheimer's and dementia wing. According to Justice, naming the facility after Rogers and putting it in southern West Virginia was a no-brainer. I don't know that it can ever do justice to the great people that we're talking about. And this incredible gentleman that was honored here today, you know, Charles Calvin Rogers, and what a what an incredible story. But absolutely, we need to step up, don't we? When it really boils right down to it, this facility is going to be state of the art, 120 beds. So many folks from southern West Virginia have been involved in the military in in countless ways, and so this facility, long, long, long overdue but something that uh, many people pulled the rope, but honest to goodness, this one I wanted and wanted really bad. So I'm really glad, glad, glad to be here with you today. Justice did not give a timeline for the project's completion, but said that he is putting a priority on getting it done as soon as possible.